Hey everybody, Jason Abelson with our final bold predictions of 2017. And we've got three fights. Are they big? Hell no. They're microscopic, featuring six of the tiniest fighters you're going to see anywhere. It's all taking place over New Year's weekend in the land of the rising sun. We start off in Yokohama, Japan. IBF junior flyweight champion Ryoichi Taguchi defending his belt against Milan Melindo. This is a battle between two guys who are very comfortable on the back foot, featuring jabs, a lot of head movement, not a lot of power. Of the two, I think Taguchi is far more varied, far more dynamic, and I like him to defend the belt via a lopsided unanimous decision. Next, we're off to Yokohama, Japan, and a battle for the WBC Junior Flyweight Championship of the World. Champion Ken Shiro defending against Gilberto Pedroza. Shiro, a very sharp, well-schooled boxer puncher, moves around the ring, operates behind a stiff jab. Pedroza, not really like that at all. Stationary, not a lot of power, not a lot of movement either. You kind of have to come to him, he'll counterpunch you. I like Shiro via convincing unanimous decision to defend his title. And lastly, boxing dorks, it's the fighter that gets you all teary-eyed, gets your heart palpating, gets you thinking, wow, he's so great because everyone tells me so. Nyana in a way, defending his WBC super flyweight world title against Frenchman, Yohan Boyeux. This is a tailor-made squash job for in a way. Boyeux keeps his hands very high, walks in very straight. In a way, as we know, a ferocious body puncher. Oh my God, he's gonna absolutely fricassee the Frenchman inside of five rounds to win and defend his title in convincing fashion to get all you cognoscente out there, all you hipsters crying again at the brilliance of this Japanese fighter. Well, what do you think, guys? Am I on point or on crack? Leave your comments in the comments section. Have a very happy and safe new year. We'll see you in 2018. Until then, keep those punches up. Take care. Bye-bye.